Hey guys, welcome back to episode number three of Satisfactory Early Release. We are going to get ready to do our hub upgrade number five. I just got done changing this over from plates to pipes. And we are going to put them in here and we should be ready to go. Alright, here we go. You guys ready? Oh, milestone unlocked. New buildings, new equipment, player upgraded. Congratulations. You have unlocked Hub Feature Molecular Analysis Machine, also known as the MAM. Building Biomass Burner. Building Space Elevator. Equipment Object Scanner. Equipment Beacon. Motivational Message. Congratulations. You succeeded in every provided task. On behalf of Fixit Incorporated, I thank you for your current and future service. That's cool. What is this? Additional knowledge. Flower the hub battles. terminal has been converted to give access to milestones hmm. there to ensure you progress along Fixit approved protocols. Mm -hmm. Additionally, the MAM provides the opportunity to send samples of xenobiology and other materials I deem relevant to R&D in exchange for appropriate rewards. Five minutes. Future developments should be aimed at constructing the space elevator and thus initiating project assembly. Good luck. Thanks, Ada. All right, so we're going to go ahead and do this stuff. We'll put that in there. All right, so we we got that going. Uh, what is the next? Oh, tier one utility. Oh, look at this biofuel. What's a lookout tower? Uh, provides a good overview use for building. Cool logistics. Cool personal storage box. Hmm. Select milestone. Um. I mean, is this all oh, the rewards? Okay, logistics. Uh, these are the rewards if we go this milestone. Personal storage. Um, I really want these conveyor splitters. So I'm going to select this one. Alright. So that's cool. And what can we make now? We can make the constructor still. And that stuff. Okay, cool. So give me a couple seconds, guys. I need to do something. We'll be right back. Alright, guys. Uh, I went ahead and... Uh, got a couple things done I actually had to change some of the um, our electric around because I have more machines than we have power and so I went ahead and turned off all the copper and here comes our friend flying through the air um, I do have all the ingredients now to go ahead and unlock this milestone so I want to go ahead and do this with you guys so let's go ahead and click on this and let's go ahead and put, uh, where did we put our sheets at? I think they're over here. Let's see this. Did, did, did the sound get reset? It seems like it. Yeah, it did. Well, that's dumb. Alright, so let's do that. And turn the music down. Okay. That's better. It should stay like that, I would think, right? But it gets reset after it. Look at that. Click apply. Yes. And save them this time, please. Apply. Okay. <laughs> okay, play. come on. I want to get out of this. Thank you. All right, let's go back here. Let's get the uh, plates out of here. Awesome. And let's go back over here. Press this. Put the plates in. Oh, my gosh. Okay, let's press the big red button. Actually, you know what? I want to take a picture of that. Can I take a picture of that? Uh, P. Oh, I can't take it. I can't go into picture mode right now. That's dumb. Okay, that's fine. Uh, let's go ahead and press it. Milestone reached. Conveyor belts can now merge and split to increase the complexity and efficiency of your factory. The productivity display will help you measure and improve the productivity oh, cool. of individual buildings to aid with optimization. Pod will return in 2 minutes and 30 seconds. 
All right, so that's cool. I also went ahead and put some stuff into this machine, and it's been analyzing. I actually found a yellow power slug. Got six minutes left until that. Um, we do have the pale berry and the alien carcass done. So I guess we have to wait till that thing comes back before I can build some new machines. It looks that way. I would have to say yes on that. Yep, two minutes. Okay, we got two minutes. And does it not look like that moon is inside the clouds? That's not good. <laughs> All right, so let's go over here. What do we got going on over here? We got 82 of those. Let's put those in here. All right, that's getting filled up. Uh, this has got a ton of probably concrete in it so we could start making foundations but I'm not ready to make foundations yet so let's put that in here I'd like to make just like a personal storage building that'd be kind of fun um, a minute left until it gets back um, let's see here what did this have in it oh we were making coils okay so that's doing its thing um, so yeah, I went ahead and explored, um, this whole basin over here, and I went up that way. There's a bunch of weird, uh, there's a weird biome up here. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, it's over there. See the weird looking trees over there? They're kind of purple. And then I went ahead and went down inside of this, uh, little bowl area here, which I think this might end up being where we end up putting our main factory. Uh, it just seems to be a good spot and there are some nodes over on that side we could still utilize these nodes uh, we could probably just have these all come down in one big huge um, oh oh hey it's back can we fly on that What do we get? Milestone exchange concluded. Fix it freighter re-entry complete. Okay, so what's that mean? What's it mean? What's it mean? Um organization production. So what's that mean? Logistics? Already unlocked. So where is it at though? Like I don't see it in here. Do you see logistics? Oh there's logistics right there. Oh sweet. Conveyor merger, conveyor splitter, merges up to three conveyor belts into one, okay, and this splits one belt into three, ah, okay, so, let's say we wanted to take both of these into one machine, like this one, we could do that, right? Yeah, that's probably what we're going to probably do. So, um, so I could probably, let's see how we want to do that. Uh, splitter. All right. So we want, this is the in and out. Hmm. No, that's not what we want. We don't want a splitter. We want the merger. Yes, we want the merger. Okay, cool. So if we did the merger, can't afford. What do we need to what? Missing iron rods. Did we put any rods in here? Yeah, we did. Okay, cool. So let's do this merger. And that's the input. That's the output. That's input, output, output. Okay, so if we wanted to line that up with that, is there a way to do that? There we go. So right there. It's a 
little bit close there, but we can see if we can get a... Alright, and then we'll put this one here. And then we'll take this one. Uh, what are we missing? Concrete. Okay. Let's go over here and grab some concrete. Alright, that works for me. And then let's take uh, this one like this. Okay, and then uh, let's say like that, right? And then we got four right there. And then that should make like a nice bend here, right? Three. And then it's still not a very pretty bend, but it'll work for now. We'll learn how to get these bins better. <laughs> it's kind of weird, isn't it? Alright, so these are all going to go into here. Alright. So these are making plates. So we could change this back to uh, rods. And we could go ahead and dump these and these in there. And these sort... Alright, so this is making plates and rods. So it's kind of taking turns. Interesting. So the next thing we need to work on is there's a there's a um, an upgrade for our power situation. So let's go to um, go to this power. Uh, oh wait 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 what did I just see? Biomass burner. Okay, burns various forms of biomass to generate electricity for the power grid. Has no input. <laughs> Makes 20 additional watts. Okay. So it requires uh, plates, all that stuff. So we could probably make one of these and set it up down there somewhere. So let's go ahead and grab some of this, some of this. And then um, some of these and some of these. All right. Uh, should we keep it right here, though? You know what? I'm actually going to put it over here. So this side gets powered with one of these. So let's go ahead and build this thing. Biomass burner. Okay. Um... Is there anything cool on it that we could... Not really. Um, I'd kind of like to have it lined up like this. Like right there. Awesome. Alright. And same, same deal here then, okay? Cool. Alright, so let's go grab some of our biomass. See if we have any left. Um, we don't have very much, do we? So let's let's go ahead and make some. Wait, uh, do we not have? There's leaves. Okay. Um, craft biomass. That's all we can make is 48 of them. Okay. So if we if we cut down this line here. Right, and we go from here to here, and then from here to here. Let's see if this thing can handle the power that we'd require. Okay, so let's go ahead and insert the fuel, and this is going to tell us right here. Let's go ahead and flip these machines back on. I think they're four megawatts a piece. I think we should be fine. Yeah, we're close. We're close. 13 megawatts. Nine megawatts. So I think we're good. This is going to take a while to get caught up because it's backlogged. 
So that's cool. There was another one that we could unlock. Uh, let's see. Active milestones. Uh, waiting resources. Um, where was that at? Utility? No. Let's see. Let's go back over here. Confirm. The crystals on this slug can be harvested and converted into two power shards that function with current fixit technology. Several buildings would be capable of performing over 100% capacity if infused. The derived blueprint is now accessible in Hub Tier 2. Hub Tier 2. Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Tier 1 object? Nope. Oh, there it is right there. Hold on. There's something under my mouse that's making it move. Okay. Uh, so we need to put one of these. Select milestone. Press the button. That's not going to lift off, is it? No. Okay. <laughs> so what did we unlock? We unlocked something. Uh, let's see here. Um, logistics. Foundations. What did we unlock? Anything special? Space elevator. Oh my gosh. Production. Smelter MK1. So it must have been over here, maybe? Nope. Maybe it's over here? I s it said we unlocked it something, didn't it? A beacon? So we can make 27 beacons. Was there something else that it's... I mean, did I, am I missing something? Okay. So I want to go back and I want to see... There was one that was more towards... Uh, this right here, this biofuel. So the most energy efficient uh, form. So we need all of this material here. This also gives us a look at. So we'll do this. Uh, let's go ahead and give it that. And that. And that. And let's go get some more plates and some more rods. So here is enough plates. And that might not be enough rods and then we just need a little bit more of that how are we looking over here pretty good okay cool all right so let's go back over here so that does that oh we're just shy crap um i could actually make some though so let's go ahead and make them over here so we need rods so we need what 24 of them all right, there's 24 of those. So let's throw those in there. Awesome. Utility and milestone unlocked. Milestone reached. You have unlocked several structures aimed to provide the first needed to build basic factory infrastructure. Yeah. Additionally, the biofuel blueprint will ensure improved fuel consumption of biomass burners. Additionally, you can now build the space elevator, which is integral to your contribution to project assembly. Sweet. Okay. So, we have power. Biomass burner. Um, I'm not seeing it, so there's the lookout tower. Here's all the new walls, right? Yeah, I'm not seeing special. The hub space elevator. I am not seeing the biofuel thing. So I don't know if that's a machine that I can make. I'm not seeing it in there. Uh, oh, it is biofuel right here. So how do you make biofuel? Apparently use this fuel. Biomass burners. So what is this right here? Biomass. So if I made biomass and turned it into biofuels, it must be more efficient. So let's just try this real quick. Let's go over here and pick some weeds. All right, and then we'll see how this all works out for us. We need to find, I don't know if there's, if this is considered biomass. Or if there's actually like a little area where you can actually mine biomass. But we'll have to figure that out. So if I go in here and I create this, right? So if I create biomass, this is making biofuel. How 
Okay, so that makes biofuel, right? So if I take that out and put that in, is that more efficient? Oh yeah, look, it slows way down. That's cool. Okay, let's go change this now. Alright, so we can make 26 biofuel for this one. Oh, here it comes. Scare the crap out of me. Okay, let's put uh, that in there. That is cool. Alright, so I don't know how we're going to harvest biomass. Um, if there's something that, like, literally, like, changes or mines trees. Um, like I said, I don't know, because this is all new to me. But I'm a f I, don't, I have a feeling we'll figure it out here pretty soon. Um, I do like gardening, though. <laughs> Let's go, um, let's go to select milestone. Let's go to personal, see, we already did all those. Uh, personal storage, it gives us a storage box. This gives us walls and stairs. Um, tier two. Oh, wow, that's a lot. Assembler, okay, so it can be a rotor, modular frame, used for crafting the moving parts of a motor. Chainsaw, railways, walkways, yellow shards. All right, so the assembler can be automated by feeding parts into it with a conveyor belt. All right, the produced parts can be automatically extracted by connecting conveyor belt. Hmm. All right, so tier two. Um. We already did this, right? So personal storage would be our next next big bet, right? And then all of this. Which I'm not ready to build like the factory yet. Um wouldn't mind having a, some storage boxes though. I wouldn't mind having that chainsaw, but that's tier two, right? Yeah. really can't do anything there so yeah I'm not really worried about the walls so let's go ahead and do this personal storage one select milestone uh, let's go ahead and throw you in there uh, throw you in there you in there and uh, let's go ahead and throw you in here and here there there that all right, let's go get some plates and some other things. So here's, let's sort this. Let's get some plates and some of those. And then we need like 200 of these. Good. Our plane is back, so it'll let us do this. So let's go this, this, and this. And let's launch it to the heavens. Milestone unlocked. Milestone reached. Additional storage options have been provided. R&D inflated your pocket dimension and developed a personal storage box accessible in the build menu. In the build menu? Like this one? I'm not seeing it in there. This is a craft menu, right? Uh, special? Space elevator hub, production, constructor smelter, logistics, foundations, organization. Oh, there it is. So, six rods, right? Alright, so let's go get the six rods. And I feel like we're not getting a lot of rods for some reason. How many plates do we have? We have lots of plates. Let's change this to rods as well. Mm, recipe rods. There we go. So let's make double the rods. Alright, so let's go over here. 
And... Oh, that's kind of cool, isn't it? Oh, but you can't set it up here? Are you kidding? Oh, man, I don't even know where I'd want to put this. I mean, I guess we could sit it right here and put the biomass in it as we make it. I mean, that'd be one thing to do, I guess. Yeah, we could do that. Put all our biomass in here. Uh, what do these beacons do? Let's go back. What do this... Uh, used to mark areas of interest displayed on your compass. Hmm. So how big is this thing? Oh, that's cool. That is cool. Alright, I don't want to use it right now, though. Let's go ahead and do this. I want to know what this is, though. I don't know what this is. Can I put that there? No. Must be something for later. I'm not quite sure. Alright, so let's go uh, wire, rods, plates. Alright, so we just need 13 more rods. And that milestone will be over. So let's throw all this back in there. Um, let's see, sort that. Do we have 13? We have 19. That's cool. Oh, how'd I do that? Just showed me the whole in, in my whole inventory. Alright, let's press the button. Alright. Milestone reached. To ensure optimal use of space, navigation, and tidiness, R&D have developed stairs and conveyor walls. That's cool. See ya. Let's pick our weeds. All right, so I guess we have walls now. Oh yeah, we have a bunch of cool looking walls. These are cool. What does it take to make it concrete? So that's kind of cool. New foundations, new stairs. It's kind of cool. All right, production. Nothing's changed there. Organization. Lookout tower provides a good overview. Uh, we could do the space elevator. That requires a whole crap. What the frick? Oh, it's that thing. Uh, it requires a whole crap load of stuff. But that might be what we have to end up making to get to the next level, you know? Alright, guys. This has been this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you click that like button. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell. And if you're playing along, let me know how you guys are doing. And where you set up your base at. And uh, I will see you next episode, guys. We'll get some uh, more equipment going here and get our factory up and running. And then maybe even go ahead and make the uh, space elevator down there. So I will see you next episode.